unveil the other side's pumpkin sambar recipe. Okay, uh, today we are going to see how to make uh, pumpkin sambar uh, in a kadai. Take some oil. I use coconut oil uh, because that adds in the flavor. Uh, and then saute the pumpkin that's diced and cubed uh, as shown here. And meanwhile, I also pressure cook uh, about. Uh, one cup of tuar dal uh, and I'll be using the homemade uh, sambar powder for this recipe uh, sometime uh, uh, very soon I'll be showing how to make the sambar powder too the pumpkin is sorted uh, so that it just gets uh, slightly tender other ingredients required are uh, salt I use the rock salt Dhania, that is the fresh coriander, curry leaves, red chilli, mustard, asafoetida, and tamarind pulp. So, uh, as I already mentioned, I'll also be requiring uh, about two teaspoons of uh, sambar powder. So now the pumpkin is almost ready. It just has to be light tender. This is the cooked pressure cooked dal. Uh, I actually add in uh, uh, about half a teaspoon of oil and uh, a pinch of turmeric when I pressure cook it. So to this I will be adding in the sautéed uh, pumpkin and uh, also all the other uh, ingredients that I have mentioned that is the sambar powder, tamarind pulp. Uh, then I'll add in uh, salt and uh, give it a quick stir and I'll cook it for one more visit You can add in little more water looking at the consistency. Uh, this uh, special, uh, this sambar specifically shouldn't be very thin. In a kadai, add in some oil and uh, once the oil is hot, add in mustard seeds. allow it to crackle and then you add the red chilies then the curry leaves and a pinch of asafoetida saute it now uh, to this uh, add in the cooked uh, sambar um, check for salt and uh, tanginess add in more salt or uh, uh, tamarind pulp if required garnish with the freshly chopped coriander leaves and enjoy this summer with the uh, hot rice like subscribe and share unveil the other side thanks